Hello and welcome to my channel guys. Today we're going to learn how to open your Premiere Pro project in a older version or we can say if you have accidentally opened your Premiere Pro project in a newer one that is 2020 or 2021 and now you're trying to open it in an older one that is 2018 or the later ones and you get uh, this kind of message. Uh, that's quite uh, shitty right if you don't know but uh, there's quite easy fix for this one. Uh, let's get in the computer for that. So before starting anything, you should have a software called 7-Zip uh, and that is available free. Well, to download this one, what you have to do is go to Google and type in 7-Zip.org. 7-Zip.org. You can download it from here. Uh, since mine is in 64-bit, I will download this one. Just hit download here and it will be downloaded. And after this is downloaded, you just have to install this software out here. Yeah. Go to the place where you have all your projects saved. After you have downloaded and installed your 7-zip, what you have to do is go in your folder where there is your projects. So I want to open this Crime 1 project in 2019 uh, Premiere Pro, but I have saved it in 2020, which this would not allow it to open without doing anything. But uh, what we can do is right click in this file and uh, let's make a copy out of it first. Crime 1 copy, right? So after this, uh, I made the copy, right click in this file, go to 7-zip and extract here, press to extract here. When you press to extract here, the new kind of file is generated that looks like this. The next step is to press right click in the newly generated file. I'll just push uh, right click and open this file with notepad. When you open this with notepad, you'll get this kind of uh, coding here. Uh, go to the fourth line out here and change this version from 38 to any kind of lower number. I'm changing this one to one. The reason you cannot open in the newer file is because this number is higher. After you change this to one, go to file and save this one. After you save this file, what you have to do is right click in the same file again, go to seven zip and press to add to archive. When you press to add to archive, uh, you'll get something like this and uh, remember this archive format should always be in ZZIP, not in any other format. And after you do that, what I like to do is change the name of the folder so that I know which one is the new one. I'll just write um, 2019 here that I can open it. And also you have to change the format of the file here from ZZ to PRPROZ. This is the format for Premiere Pro and press OK. When you have uh, this one saved out like this, after you have done all of those steps, the next step is to opening this in Premiere Pro. Let's open up Premiere Pro. So after you open a Premiere Pro, let's uh, hit to open project and go to your project. Open the file that we have saved. That was in, that was the name with crime. And yes, it will just say that uh, the project has been saved uh, uh, from a previous version of Adobe Premiere Pro must be converted. The original file will not be modified uh, and you just have to con press OK in this one and your project will be opened in 2019 version of Premiere Pro, although it has been saved in uh, any newer version. I hope that was helpful and now you can open all your Premiere Pro projects in any version you want. Uh, hit the like button if you like the video, subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.